Aero Finance has almost 5x in the last week alone. Let's have a look at what's behind all of this. Let's see how long this rally could potentially last. Let's look at fair valuations to other decentralized exchanges. Here's the rally I'm talking about. We are currently at 47 cents. And the first time I heard about Aero was on January 26, when one of our tracked wallets, a venture capitalist firm, bought into it. So that was at 7.6 cents. So that's a clean 6x from the current price. So here is when Venture Capital buys in. Here is where we started discussing this in our chat. So on the 28th, since then the price doubled. So if you're actively trading, if you're looking for the next small cap gem, feel free to check out the premium membership link is down below thebitcoinstrade.com. Now let's have a look at what this is all about. Aerodrome is a decentralized exchange on the base blockchain. So the blockchain that has been issued by Coinbase. And you can simply swap tokens as with any other decentralized exchange. You can also provide liquidity with quite nice APRs and you can lock up some tokens and get also relatively attractive APRs. And that then leads to the total value locked increasing for Aerodrome. So more and more capital is flowing into the system. Now BASE is currently the 13th largest blockchain in terms of total value locked just above Cardano and Kronos just below Sui and Manta. And the reason why Aerodrome is so interesting is that it's already the largest decentralized exchange on BASE. So it's not just a contender, it's already the largest. It's got a total value locked of 212 million, four times the size of Uniswap. So we can definitely conclude that there is adoption. We can definitely conclude that there will be probably even rising demand. So the demand side is okay. What about the supply side though, right? Price is the result of demand versus supply. The scary thing with any new crypto project is always token inflation. So new tokens that get issued to early backers, early investors, they then can dump on retail. And what we see here is that Aero does have support by Coinbase, so from the base ecosystem fund. And we can also see that the fully diluted market cap is 380 million. The current market cap, so the floating tokens, is only 78 million. In other words, only 20% of tokens are currently floating. The supply will 5x. So if during that unlock period, Aerodrome doesn't grow by 5x, then the price will go down. What about fair valuations though? Is this currently a fair price for Aerodrome? Let's compare this with Uniswap. Uniswap has a market cap of 7.4 billion and it's got a total value locked of 5.7 billion. So the market cap is roughly 30% larger than the total value locked. For Aerodrome, the total value locked is 212 million. The market cap is 381 million. So here we've got an 80% premium over the total value locked. So technically Aerodrome is currently more expensive dollar for dollar. But again, this is the fully diluted market cap. This is not the current market cap. Relative to the current market cap, it's super cheap. So the big question is whether or not Aerodrome can further attract more capital. This will likely be very much dependent on how much focus Coinbase puts on its base chain. Will Coinbase focus all of its efforts now on the Bitcoin ETF and on institutional clients or will it still support base? That's the big central question. That's in the end what's also going to drive activity on the largest decentralized exchange. I think the pricing of Aerodrome is pretty fair and especially in the current bull market, I do believe this price can rally quite a bit further. If it's your first time here, feel free to subscribe. I publish videos regularly. A like would be very much appreciated as well. It helps the channel grow. There's also a free Telegram. Link is down below.